Well, welcome back. This is the official start of the new series I'm doing, where I just cover the entire forecast, uh, like radar forecast and temperature with the U.S. And since it is winter, that would also include winter accumulations. Um, so, how this is going to play out, I'm just going to go from east coast to west coast with radar, and then west coast to east coast with uh, snow accumulations, and then east coast to west coast with temperatures. Um, so it's just going to go back and forth like like a, like a ping pong, essentially. So starting with the east coast, doesn't appear to be much except for the system on the right hand of, left hand of the screen. There may be some late lake effect snow coming into play, it seems like. Um, but that system definitely comes into play. Um... So there's that. Actually, gonna get a better view of the system here. Um, but yeah, this may be named, and if it is, it would be Winter Storm Ward. Um, actually, I'm gonna look that up now, because if this is Winter Storm Ward, um. Then, okay, so we do not have Winter Storm Ward, um, yet. So, because of that fact, it won't be labeled as Winter Storm Ward, it'll be labeled as whatever title I name this series, and playlist, the corresponding playlist. Um, so going west, doesn't appear to be anything up until actual west coast and I would also be going over Hawaii and, and Alaska so there is some rain showers in New Mexico and Texas maybe a cell pops up may go severe can't be ruled out but but thunderstorms aren't even forecasted today so I doubt that's gonna happen um, so there's that um, now we will go for Alaska. I'm trying to capture the entire state. Um, it's a big state. And I guess Hawaii is also going to be covered in this. Um, but I'll actually zoom in onto Hawaii after we're done with Alaska. Uh, it does appear to be some snow showers near Anchorage. And there is a big picture. Um, some snow coming in from the Arctic. And then there's snow coming in for the Aleutians. Um, but yeah. Now, we will zoom in onto Hawaii. Which, rain showers coming in from the west, actually. May lead to snow on the peaks with Mauna Loa and Mauna Kea. Um, Actually, with that sitting there, cannot really rule out a, a flash flood warning popping up for Hilo. And did I see snow? Did I see snow? Yeah. There's snow on the peak of Mauna Loa. As I did mention, that would be a possibility. So we are looking at possible snow today in Hawaii. Um... And then there's this system here that just sits off the coast, so that could cause some rough surf. So, yeah, there's that. And then we will go for snowfall accumulations. First with Hawaii, because, you know, the peaks. Then Alaska, the entire state. Yeah, quite a bit up here with the... Um, atmospheric river that's coming in. West coast. Um, doesn't appear to be much in the way of gaining snow. Main story would be this sis system with snow. Um, there is not really much in the way of gaining snow for the east either. Um, now we will go for temperature. 
We're sure we could have access to win, but that's a premium thing. So, yeah. 57 Savannah, 39 DC, 33 New York, 22 Montpelier. Um, I guess 32 Dayton, Ohio. I... Okay. No, I did not want that. I wanted to swipe. It did not want to swipe. Uh, 65 Panama. No, no but pen, like more or less Pensacola, not Panama City. But Panama City is probably in the probably in the sixties right now, anyways. Thirty three Kenosha, thirty one. I want to say Davenport, sixty eight West of New Orleans, sixty nine Austin, fifty five Oklahoma City, thirty five South of Omaha. I'm not sure what town would be where that thirty one is. It's north of Sioux Falls and Sioux City. Uh, 33 Cheyenne, 44 Albuquerque, 41, I'm not sure what place that would be, um, in Utah, west of Salt Lake, 64 south of Phoenix, 11 Jackson, uh, 35 near, I want to say Glacier uh, Park, but I could be completely wrong, 29 near Orville, Washington, 70 L.A., then there's a 45 and uh, 49 and 35 in Cal in Northern California. Got an earthquake in Nepal. Now we'll go for Hawaii, not Hawaii, Alaska, and then Hawaii. Um, I'll actually, just break it up in parts. I actually should have just did this with, with Alaska. Um, 41 Sitka. There's seven there, t uh, seven below. 24 below in Fairbanks, 13 Anchorage, 27 Kodiak, negative um, 11 Bethel, uh, there's a negative 24, that's the coldest I've seen so far with Fairbanks and a couple other places, 13 below there, um, n like teens below zero, negative 10 with that location which used to be Burrow and is now that name. Wait, there's islands out the coast? I did not know there's islands up here. Um, there's three with the little Demonide islands. I'm not sure this is Russia or um, Alaska. But now for Hawaii, with 59 near the peaks, it looks like. 61, 70s, 70s and 80s appear to be r commonplace, and obviously with the higher ele elevations, it's colder. Um, so, with that, that does seem to be it. Um, 29 Toronto, though. Yeah, we're looking at... And also, long-range models have a, another snow system coming in for the south at the turn of the month. Not as bad as Valentine's Day week, but it's going to be salt on the wounds. Um, but anyways, that does seem to be it. Stay safe. See you in the next video. Bye.